MacBook Air so far is phenomenal. Students love it. They are loving all the capabilities that they're able to have with it. Here the district had talked about rigor and relevance in the classroom and this MacBook Air is a great tool to enhance that. For rigor, there are numerous opportunities for us now to look out and research into the real world and delve more into actually what, what's going on and so making it more difficult to be in, uh, in for our education and then more relevant to our lives. I use the textbook online to do uh, problems and Calc Chat is a good thing for pre-calc because it'll show you how to work the problems in pre-calc. It has really impacted my learning so far this year. It's technology and math and science-based world right now and everything is changing so the more you can learn about it, the better. Kind of what we need in high school for we can be prepared for after high school with more up-to-date technology. The fact that uh, my learning is I believe that they uh, better prepared us for just like life after high school because um, with the world the way it's going now technology is becoming a big part of it and you know you, you, you get a good idea of how to use it properly and all the resources that are, are available for it and, and another thing for it uh, being a high school student is college applications and things of those nature are so much easier to do with the technology at your fingertips. It's here to like be connected to the world, honestly, because as the world gets more and more virtual, just like things like these computers are helping us uh, like learn better, obviously. Esta es mi casa. Tiene un planta. Bienvenidos. Este es mi dormitorio. En mi dormitorio, los muebles importantes son mi cama. Mi cómoda. Y... I don't collect till I tell you. Let's don't get. Notice I keep that straight, hit collect, and keep walking with the car, catch up with the car. Notice it's straight all the time. Are you collecting? Yeah. And how mass affects the amount of force that needs to be applied to move a certain object. And what we did is we used this toy car and we increased the mass. Um, and as you can see, this graph tells us that as we increase the mass, the force needed also goes up. Uh, so we took a video of the car and did stuff to make the position we time find our trailer speed, which is 0.6. And then we set it up on uh, one of the poles back there. So recently we've been using iMovie on our new MacBook Airs to create movie trailers for our Gold Medallion exhibition proposal. Without GarageBand, without the help from it, I probably wouldn't have made it to state with my solo. Because that helped me a lot, that helped me look through it and be like, okay, Here's the mistakes, here's why I need to make a difference. So without that, I wouldn't have made an alternate. He actually recorded a background music for us, and then we recorded ourselves playing a solo at home. So that way, there was kind of um, a context that was outlined for us, so we could have help and know what to do, but also the, the freedom to do it by ourselves. First, you're just playing the head of the song, which is the outline music, and then it will turn into a solo eventually. Hearing me, I can turn myself up. I believe that the Macs are a very good investment because there are a number of things that we can do now that we couldn't do before. It makes learning much more interactive, so uh, it's much more enjoyable, and when it's more enjoyable, uh, there's a lot more chance that more learning will take place. And the teachers are doing a very good job of enforcing, you know, 
using laptops for the right reasons. And when we first got the Macs, it was like kind of hard to use because not everyone uses a Mac, most people use PCs. So it was kind of like going to a different country and like trying one of their things out and being like, oh, how do you use this? But once you get the hang of it, it loads so much faster. It's so much easier to do homework if your homework's on the internet. And it's, it's the new thing, basically.